In my last series, which was the hardcore one, I survived for 1,500 days almost, and I never built something nice for my farm animals. So today, I'm gonna build a beautiful barn, a sheep farm for wool, and a big field with so much stuff for my farm animals to be happy. So, let's go! Guys, I love you so much. Your feedback is amazing and I'm so happy. For the library, all of you wanted the second floor to be for librarian villagers, which I did. We have all these villagers now with a very good box trading. Let me show you. Protection IV, Infinity, co Affinity, Mending, Efficiency IV, and Breaking 3, Power V, Sick Touch, and we have one, two, three villagers left so we can have more books. Maybe Fortune that I'm missing, but I don't need it. I don't want to waste more time because this place needs interior and I have done it and got a maps for the Wolford land. Look at it. This is the library. This is where we are. This is the starter house. This is the villager breeder slash pumpkin and melon farm. And this is the tree trapping center. I mean, we have so much so far. And this is my nether portal. Look at this. This place is amazing. For the interior, I have so much planned. And I'm not gonna do them yet because there is something else I want to take care of first. You. And definitely you. And some maybe glass as well. I need wool as well. What I want is I want to build a little house for this lovely, beautiful and cute wolf. So let's do it. And there you go. A little beautiful house for this beautiful creature. Now let's move on to the next thing. After I finished the last episode and we have done the ore collection, I found out that I'm missing the emerald in this one. With this lovely farmers and this lovely farms, I have this many of emerald. This is so crazy. Oh, so much emerald. So what I need is a block and one piece. Now this collection is done. Except for the block of the netherite. If I have time today, I will go netherite right mining now let's go back doing the interior of the second floor of the library for that i'm gonna need a lot of stuff I have done it. The second floor is looking so amazing. When I start this interior at first, I struggled because things doesn't look good at the start. You need to trust the process. And that's what I did. So let me show you what I have for the interior of the second floor. Welcome. This looks so good. So the first thing you see when you come up is this land map. As you can see, this is our land. It's looking beautiful. Behind you, you're gonna see this flower display. It's a beautiful corner. In the middle, we have this meeting table. And in the left and the right, we have some reading, a chill area as well, sitting. It's beautiful. And this area is where I have my desk and the employees. I love my desk area. I mean, look at it. This is so beautiful and cozy. We have some displays. We have some foliage all around. This flower blossom is amazing. We have, you know, leaves and everything, chandeliers. I'm loving this interior. While I was doing the interior, of course, the farms were working. Which farms? I mean the pumpkin and the melon farms. Which means I can now trade and get some XP. Let's fix my tools. Oh my gosh. All this emerald and I did not zombify the villagers. Oh, it's amazing. When it comes to wood, it's easy to collect. All the wood types I have is all easy to collect in the street trapping area. Except of one tree, which is the mangrove tree. And I really want to build with that block. It's so beautiful red. So, I want to build a farm just for it. This farm requires two things that I don't own. One is dead coral and the second is slime so much slime and so much blocks of slime so i need to make another farm which one is more fun we're gonna go look for the coral biome and i need my boat and let's go sail honestly i've been traveling so far and i don't have a light right yet which means i'm gonna use the chunk base seed and look for a desert like the closest one so i don't have to travel very far 
I actually so glad that I checked because the deserts that I have in this seed are so far away. Imagine go looking without knowing. The closest one is 2,000 blocks away. 2,500 actually. It's gonna be a long journey and it's this way. Um, so no ocean, but still, I have my boat. Before we go, I have something special I wanna do. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot about it. Whoopsie. I need emeralds. A lot of emeralds. First thing, I need food. Second, I need name tags. Oh, I forgot the interior. Looks so good. Now these librarians, no one is up to level where I can buy the name tags. Which means I need to upgrade one of them. I think I'm gonna just uh, upgrade the mending. I already been doing some. Hello, villager. Please be good to me. Come on. There we go. Does anyone sell the bookshelves? Um, you are available, you know what? So let's uh, take this one and make this one here a special one. Loyalty? I don't need loyalty. This is not how I expect I'm gonna be going to build the farm. What's protection? Are you kidding me? Okay, I'm just gonna take the bookshelves. And I do have sick touch on my axe, which means I need another axe. I'm not gonna waste my diamonds. I'm just gonna see what I can find. Which I don't. Let's make an iron one. With these books, now the bookshelves here looks not empty anymore. And we can get more now that we have so much emeralds. Why did I not think about this? I'm so dumb. Oh my gosh, 13? Dude, who do you think you are? Well, I'm just gonna stick with the mending guy. Where is it? This one. Well, where are you books? Oh, this looks so good. This feels this much. Do I risk it for this? I don't have any other choice. I need to upgrade him. It's so painful. Even though this hurts. But the books can be used like so let's take more empty ones non-enchanted ones and continue doing so let's put the books back well i'm gonna buy clocks you know what this library should do some clocks the name tag thank you very much i need two and i already have one so three i think that's all i need but you know what i'm just gonna buy a bunch or maybe more there goes all my emerald I feel that part and that part the much because when you come in, this is what you face first. Bookshelves now are not empty. Oh, I love it. Now we can trade and fix my sick touch pickaxe. Let's leave the axe right here because I really don't want to go back to the library. Because of you, I have names for the wolves, which I'm so happy and beyond. Just having your names here with me in the same world, it's, it's something I really appreciate. This little guy can be bluey. This orange guy can be Millie. Millie is a name for a girl. I shouldn't be saying guy. And for the library, this magenta boy can be Coda. Honestly, I don't know the names for the girls or either the boys. Doesn't really matter, right? All of you are adorable. I love you all. And thank you so much again for the name suggestions. It's amazing. Now let's go and explore the world looking for the desert. I have my boat. I have my sick touch. Yeah, I have everything. I'm all prepared and good. Let's go. We need to go this way. No, this way. This, yes, this way. We have another snowy biome this way. Oh my gosh. I do not like the snow biome. It's the reason why I died in my heart. Or why not some food and wood? Is this tall grass? Oh yes, I'm gonna take this. This item I cannot get. Only from chests. Another one. I'm gonna leave this one here. Just in case I lose this somehow what that view is i love this view imagine a house here with smokes and this is the view the background of your building wow we oh my gosh look at that you can have a way going up right here and then turn then here you can have a big wheel here with water okay, i'm gonna take a screenshot it's so nice when you explore and find in these amazing places where you can have more ideas for your world I'm sorry, but I need all of you. I just remembered something that I need as well for the farm, which is powdered snow. <sighs> now I'm so next to a mountains, I don't have my buckets. I know what I'm doing with my life. I need to go in. I need the iron. How much do I have? I have five. Three more so I can make a furnace. You're disgusting. 
let's take you all guess what this is powdered snow i can tell and i need three more which means this can make me three wow exactly just one piece more perfect and this place is amazing too i loved it i'm gonna take a screenshot by the way the other deserts are actually 4,000 blocks away it is far but so difficult with these mountains and i do complain a lot i know i think we are here because i can see a desert village does this village have a camel it does so beautiful i didn't notice that we are in the mesa well i guess it's calling for a a portal here <gasps> another pillager outpost five six seven pages are you serious i need a portal right here so we can go to the desert to collect sand in the future and to this place to collect terracotta i thought 2000 blocks is easy to go but now we have mountains in between that's why i'm thinking of the nether now that is a temple to four la's again what is this cage I am better situated now as you can see I have the brush and my inventory now it's clean so let's head to this temple and start from there you can go your turn this one so this is the room we have two more oh my gosh I can see the stairs I need my flashlight is it always just shirts nothing special emerald hmm. TNT and this is the end of it really well free sand Whee! i need tnt actually okay not bad okay the exact same stuff nothing exciting you as well so i didn't find anything that is um let's say rare or special like a book or anything just a golden apple and that's it now this temple is done let's move on to the next one which is the pillager outpost piercing iv not bad i'll take it the only reason that i'm looking for the desert is because of the coral looking around i found that the coral is over there but so so tiny here we are this is it i don't know the difference between all of them so let's the one that i need is tube coral which look like this i don't know which kind i need it's not following the shape it's following the color Oh, this is gonna be a beautiful floor. Now I got it. Now I just need to go back home. I have nothing else I need from here. My horse is so happy, which makes me so happy too. He's enjoying this so much. Now I need to make the slime farm. In my Minecraft life, I did two slime farms. One was eh, and the other one was great. I'm just gonna do it again. But first, I need to find a swamp. Let's stay here since it's night and go look for... The swamp i have checked and i know exactly where it is just in the ocean this time so it's easy but this time i will take some obsidian with me i need two more pieces my flint and steel i have it on me things are going so great i need seven stacks of any block so i'm gonna use my deep slate next is two stacks of scaffolding this exactly amount but i'm just gonna take more just in case a stack of torches 40 powered rails, 16 rail, 9 redstone torches, 16 fences, 2 chests, 6 hoppers, 1 with minecart chest, 1 carved pumpkin which we can take from here from this patch, 4 blocks of iron. Okay, so this amount should give me what I need. And there we go, 53. For the magma blocks, I have only 6. I need 46. Now this is all the materials that I need for the farm and there is other blocks. I need dirt and I need slabs. For the slabs, I'm gonna take my stone cutter with me so I can collect there and use it to craft the slabs. And for the dirt as well, I'm gonna collect it from there because it's uh, 2,000 blocks away. You know, it's a long way. I'm a lazy girl. It's fine. We're all lazy. This is the swamp. There is a special flower as well here. I feel like here is gonna be good because it's all water. Now what I need now is to make a portal, then we can just build. Let's do it.
We are home. I miss this place. I have been AFK for so long in the slime farm, which is working so much good. We have almost 9 stacks of slime blocks. That's a lot of slime. As well, I got the blue orchid from there and the lily pads. I killed a hoglin in my way and it dropped the head. It is something cool that we can display. Yeah, why not? And for the lily pads, I have a small pond next to the melon farm right here, so let's just put some. Hello, lovely. What's your name, Millie? Hello, Millie. I need 36 blocks. Yeah, I need 36 blocks of slime. The rest is gonna be easy, so let's collect all of them. The farm is done, is working perfectly, except for one thing. The down thing about this farm is I don't get the public eels back, which means I need to build another farm next to it here so we can have enough of the saplings of the tree. And I need some resources now. More resources. This is all the materials that I'm going to need for the farm. I'm going to build it next to the actual farm of the tree. I'm going to build it, get the public eel and AFK the actual farm for half an hour so we can have plenty of mangrove wood which i'm so happy to get all right let's do it after i've came for almost 20 minutes ish this is how much I got. This is amazing. We're gonna now start building the barn, finally. Now I'm just gonna take some blocks, some deep slates maybe. That's what I have the most. I have 34 levels, which means I can now enchant a hoe. Maybe sick touch because I'm in need of leaves a lot. Please be sick touch. Fortune 3, okay. Why did I do that? I don't know. I just wasted 3 levels. This is a breaking. Just in breaking. I don't have levels, so I'm just gonna now count on the books. Hello. Oh, my library is looking so good. Now we have a safe touch hoe. It's not the spruce leaves that I need. I need dark oak because this is the ones that I'm using. Because it has this uh, lovely texture. I need scaffolding. Yeah, I used all my scaffoldings in the farms. Now the plan for the barn, I want to have a building right here next to the pond the pond is gonna stay i'm gonna text it after because i really want to expand it connect to the ocean and have a secret entrance from the docks in the future while we have docks here it's gonna be amazing so let me clear the area do some planning and then we will see where we're gonna go from there I have now the building it is a barn a farm it's so much and i still didn't do the inside the interior because i want to start first with the sheep farm so it can produce while i do the rest now let me show you what i have inside for now we have this room it's gonna house the sheep farm we have four here four here which means eight and downstairs we have another eight so it's 16. now this side 
is this bridge or what can you call this it's so so amazing to spell by the way i did not say that i'm so happy with it it has so many things and it's all connected anyway so this bridge have two entrances the one to the sheep farm and one to this side this side's gonna be a little house for me here so we're gonna have a kitchen maybe and a living room downstairs and a bedroom right here and then an office maybe office in a in a farm i don't know in this room obviously it's calling for a storage room and because it's gonna be a storage i have multiple of access to it from this tiny house that's mine and from here which is above the sheep farm and another actually access from down from the bridge so i can access it that quickly i have this trick that i always use and from this side i have just a, a gate now I just need to make the sheep farm, but when it comes to the iron to craft the hoppers and everything else, I don't have any. Every episode I feel like I need more iron and I need to go mining again. I really want to have a farm, but not yet, because throughout the series we're going to have multiple empires. Like this land, the Warfold is going to have the mangrove from there as a wood type and the wool from the sheep farm from the barn. That's what I want this land to have, and other future empires will have other things. Any water caves? It's not a lot of iron, but one diamond. Oh, this is an empty one. Okay, I'm gonna use this actually. What it gone? What the heck? What? Wait a second, let me check again for the. Oh, now we can see a map. What? What are you doing here? Do LA teleports? I feel like they teleport. If so, where is the other two that I'm missing? Since it's here, I feel like it's either in here or in here. Yes, I was right. <gasps> so much of iron. Can I have your head? Because you look so cute. No. What about you? No. Yes. <gasps> I got it. I got it. I got it. Okay, I just, I just want to try it. Leave me alone, skeleton. <gasps> I'm a bat. Is this the new texture of the bat from the game? That looks so cool. I'm not a big fan of the bats in IRL, but in Minecraft, something else. I love them. I am finally home. I went 1,000 blocks away. And I got a lot of iron, as you can see. And I left my boat as well somewhere, I don't know where, with my LA too. I'm just gonna smelt them now and craft all we need for the sheep farm. All right you and you give me a puppy come on so you and you are coming with me you're gonna stay there because you are so adorable above that block let's have a wolf right here there okay oh this looks so weird uh-uh you can just sit here next to the dogs two wolves which means two new names can you do it guys please one more thing i need to show you and that is i found the emerald or block when i was doing the ravine next to the barn which means i'm only missing the deep slate one and the block of netherite and we will be done with this collection it's so awesome the sheep was a struggle but i got all 16 and now we have the wool for the wool factory this is so cramped i know but we have every now color of wool now i'm displaying the wools but some of them are not sheared yet so once they are sheared i will display the rest wool fort is getting bigger and bigger oh, amazing and for that special pink sheep that has a spawn by its own and i kept it really really safe so i can have it right here somewhere in a special place yeah i'm thinking of having him right here and he can go down because it's too high and his ai will not tell him to go down where there is no block down you know maybe i'm gonna call him the wolf or dwarf sheep i will think about it later but for now he is really really cool right there and with that we have a barn sheep farm this building is huge can house a lot of things and as well endermans but anyway now i'm gonna focus in the outside and then i will see if i can do the interior would you look at our barn this barn turned out to be so so cool than i ever imagined the tree the fields there's so much i want to show you so let me give you a tour let's start from the entrance wolford barn i need a glow ink but now let's go enter and we have a field not one but two next to that huge tree as well and we have on this hill 
a fishing pond as you can see it's so beautiful and i love it i need some strings for those sugar canes so i have different heights and a small tree here and a well down here with a lantern and this huge bucket this is our animals chickens cows oh sorry and the sheep the sheep i want them to be white but still the chickens are white so i don't know we have a chicken coop right here so small so beautiful and i have something really really cute around we have rabbits houses like small and tiny we have one here one there and one right over there and the barn i have done some interior so let's start first with the storage room this room you tell me what to do Ta -da, this is our storage this can hold everything that the barn can produce and we have already some eggs this is for my house and this is my bedroom again i didn't do it but i have done the kitchen yes this is our kitchen it's so beautiful and cozy i need the kitchen because next thing i want to do is the collection for this episode the collection is going to be for food crops which i'm so excited for but first i cannot wait to get the rabbits from the snowy biome stupid me was not recording and i was talking to myself only which is awkward but i got the mini blocks from the traveler i did have loom before so that's not i won't count that but we got the raw iron block furnace pumpkin crafting and coal block i love this data pack it's so 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 adorable and cute and for the rabbits, they are now in the barn. But first, I need a glow ink, which I can get actually from the kitchen that I was in. Glow ink goes to the sign. It's amazing and the symbols are so much more beautiful. We have the rabbits and I freed the animals, cows now, chickens. It's so awesome. The chickens next to the coop and the cows in the fields. It's so amazing. I love Minecraft animals, even though they look so weird. Right here, darling, right here. There you go. We're gonna sit right there. Yeah. Maybe another house for you as well. We are having a lot of houses with the wolves. It's so adorable. This place looks so homey. It's so cozy. And the area is going bigger and bigger. Wolf Lord is the best empire I have ever built in Minecraft. And hopefully I can do more in the future with the other empires. I'm loving this series. Before I go with this collection even more further. So I need a deep slate emerald ore block of netherite let's say netherite block and we need the flowers for the flowers i need the weather flower chorus fruit i'm not pronouncing anything right i know and this is just random like notes for me okay for this collection i have lists that i found online this is for the first list so where's my book let's put down next page because we're gonna look for this stuff enchanted golden apple each root and that's it for the first list perfect you two need to meet okay wow that was so magic because doing the list now i noticed that i don't have pigs in my barn oh i cannot keep up with minecraft don't tell me you are the only one here i went ahead and enchanted a fishing rod because i need a puffer fish now my electricity went off which i lost the footage oh, puffer fish okay all right so let's put that to the collection and move on to the next list one two and this is the third one which right there for the fourth list we need the cooked food now for the fifth we need a lot of things it includes um rabbit soup dried kelp yeah let's do them all as much as it sucks it's a reality it happened twice i lost the footage and i lost this time my world save thank god there is a solution but i don't have my statistics which is very very sucks because i like to keep an eye on them all the time and see how much i'm doing ah <sighs> this is collection number one this is number two three four five okay i was actually worrying about this the most because i really don't want to make that soup again okay not very bad all right let's keep going the deep dark i remember once i was doing the strip mining i got the effect this is the end of the longest tunnel i have ever done in the strip mining let's just keep going because this way i got the effect this is it i need to be shifting from now on then please okay we're safe we're safe and we got it so since it's safe i think the chest is well and nope no one shared the golden apple but a lot of new stuff which i will take all okay this is our first strike 
Okay, second strike, let's go. This is the third. One more and I'm out. <gasps> Finally! Thank you very much. Oh my gosh. Protection 3. And a very good hoe. Name tag, switch sneak one, and a very good hoe as well. I'm gonna take it. There is some lava here and I feel like this is where I came from. Yes, it is. Ah, oh, we did it. We defeated the deep dark with three strikes let's go home i'm so happy now even though i lost the statistics let's put the candles maybe right here and lit them of course up here maybe here yeah that's good maybe just one so we can see it and another one right here perfect now for the books let's fill this empty bookshelves for the swift sneak 3, of course, I want it to be in my pants. Look at me go. And for the last thing, let's head to the barn. Oh, it's so lovely here. And put this in the collection. Which means now I'm only left with the beetroot. So let's get it. There is the village. I cannot tell which one is the beetroot. This one. Two seats, not bad. LA. Let's go. The last stop to the kitchen. Needs to go here. Beetroot right here. And the seeds. Let's put them right here. I just need now the church flower. And we will be done. Thank you. Finally. I added a couple of trees. Now I feel like the barn is more full. And with that everyone. I feel like I achieved so much for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed as much as I did. And I will see you next time. Bye bye.